Hey guys, today I'm gonna show you how to make a still air box out of a used fish tank and some plastic wrap. Uh, you can also use saran wrap as a substitute. Um, so basically I'm just gonna wrap the wrap around the top <clears throat> about two thirds of the open face of this fish tank here. Um, and the benefit of using a fish tank, it's transparent, unlike these uh, plastic totes that people typically use. Um, you also have a little more uh, room under where the wrap ends to move your hands around a bit more freely. Um, whereas with the totes, you know, typically you'd cut a circular hole or two circular holes and uh, you're kind of limited with your hand movements, uh, which can be extremely annoying. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and show you what I do with the wrap. All right, so you can see I wrapped the wrap around, let's say the top two thirds of the open face of this fish tank, um, giving me the bottom third to stick my hands in and kind of move around and do whatever I need to do in there. Um, another alternative would be uh, something I've done before, uh, setting this top uh, part of the wrap a little higher so like the halfway point and then doing a second layer over the bottom and having a slight overlap uh, with the edges of the saran wrap or plastic wrap, whatever you're using. And then you can kind of just slip your hand in. Um, but that's more if you want to be really anal about it and you're afraid that this bottom third being exposed is going to introduce uh, dirt or any kind of contamination but i've definitely gotten away with just uh wrapping it around the top two thirds um <clears throat> and like i said you know this tank is a little more transparent than the plastic totes that t people typically use um, you have more freedom with your hands and uh, one of the best things is this is free. Uh, I had a friend give me this. He wasn't using it anymore. Um, you know, these plastic totes are really expensive that people use and uh, the price seems to only be going up. Um, fish tanks are pretty ubiquitous. You can find them at garage sales and probably Goodwill. In this case, I got it from my friend. Um, I also got the plastic wrap for free. I just found it. Um, so that's another benefit of doing the fish tank technique. Um, and then, you know, if you d decide one day you want to upgrade to a laminar flow hood or something, um, you can still utilize this for, say, storing agar plates or uh, taking spore prints in. Um, I find it's really useful for that, you know, it keeps, uh, you know, dirt from falling on to the aluminum foil and you can easily take it out when you're ready. Um, so yeah, I think that concludes uh, this video.